<laughs> hey everybody, on this episode of Mr. Fix, we're going to show you how to fix a chair that accidentally broke by somebody who's had a little bit too much wine. It's a broken name. You're supposed to look at the fucking camera. <laughs> <laughs> Alright everybody, so morning after, even this thing even came off. So, anyways, take a look at your bottom here. And as you can see, there was some holes that were pre-done. They ripped out, and I actually even did some other ones, and they ripped out again. So now I gotta, what I did was, made a template just to make sure of where the holes are gonna be. So, take a guess. I'm gonna keep turning it until I run out of places to go. So anyways, I put the template on and I marked it. I marked it approximately where I'm gonna do the holes, and like that, like that, that was this one. This one I even did a little pilot hole here just to make sure that'll be my first one there. So that's about it. Then you just wanna make sure that everything's about center or anything like that, that's okay. Now what you're gonna do here, we're gonna use the existing one. Really simple, this is hardwood, let's Let's pre-drill. Make sure you don't drill too much. Put a piece of tape or something like that. And then that way there, you know you're not gonna go too deep on it, okay? So that's fine. I think that'll be pretty good. Now, next step, we're gonna flip it over. Uh, we're gonna start, okay, I'm actually gonna make things simpler. I should be around that section to kind of like do these guys here. That's fine. With the bracket and everything, these screws won't go in all the way anyways. So once that's done, just a matter of lining it up and make sure that we put it in the right hole and screw it down. Let's see here next. Let's improvise on Mr. Fix. All right guys, the only thing that you gotta be careful of is notice on this, there's a low point and there's a high point. So the high point, this spacing, should be more towards the front or else it won't sit properly. So when we attach, make sure that that, like that, is more on the front side of it. So you gotta be kinda careful of. And let's see here, something like that. Hopefully that'll work. Remember that these aren't the original holes that we're doing here. Now we're just going to try to line up that first one. And what you see here is there's a notch on most of these trees, uh, on these trees, on these chairs, in order to screw it in. So we want to make sure that that first one we line up with that first new hole that we got. Now right here. Now, I'm not going to drill it all the way in because I want to make sure all my other ones line up that way there, just in case I have to play with it. Play with it a little bit. Put the washer exactly the same as the other one. Then all you do with this thing is you just turn it to the other hole that you have. There's another hole there. And as you can see, there's that hole that I have right there. That's why you don't tighten it up all the way. Because just in case you're going to move it a little bit, you're able to do that. I'll just get another one. And I'll go back after and tighten it up now. It should be a lot easier to turn. See, there's that little hole there. You see it? And 
this one. You notice that's why we didn't tighten it up because sometimes you just might have to do it a quarter turn here and a quarter turn there to get it. This one being the last one, I could probably go to town on it. This one's not even. All right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go around all the other ones, make sure they're nice and tight. Let's not try to over tighten them because the, what will happen is you think you're turning them but all they're doing is just spinning and then wrecking the wood. Just remember that that spacing goes at the front or else it won't sit properly. So that's good. Stool's all corrected. And the only thing that you guys have to remember is that when you're drinking late at night with friends and family, maybe tell them to drink responsibly. Thanks for watching, Mr. Fix. Good luck with your stool uh, fix a job. <laughs>